lovelies and welcome back to my channel long time no see if you are new here welcome i am so sorry for not being able to post every single week as i promised i had several videos that were filmed on my phone and unfortunately i was never able to transfer them from my phone to my laptop to edit and um i don't know what's going on i don't know um i have an android and a mac so there's something going on with the Android transfers, something or other, but I lost so many videos because of that. So I'm just recording on my camera and hopefully I can figure that out. If not, um, that's a lot of footage that I lost. But anyways, if you see some older videos, um, I'll kind of like put a disclaimer or something, but that is why the videos will be kind of out of order you guys are here for the haul so let's jump right into that it was my birthday recently and my husband went all out as he does all the time and so i got some goodies some of the things well actually most of the things i know where they're from some of the things i do not because of course they were presents but um again if i remember i will try to link all the items that i can in the description box below um if not if you do want help to find an item in this haul just please uh, let me know in the comments and i will help you i'm going to have to do the birthday series again because i do have a lot of items to share and so in this haul, I'm going to do Sephora, Lululemon, Amazon, and Victoria's Secrets, and then we'll we'll take it from there. So if you guys are interested, then just keep on watching. The first birthday gift was this haircut. It is awfully short. This is the shortest my hair has ever been. It's looking a little Princess Diana-esque. It was very, very like fluffy, so I added the headband, the trusty headband. Um, but that's just how it goes. Whenever I have to film, my hair never looks good. I was literally home all week and it looked perfect. So let's um, do Sephora first because it's right on my desk. Let's see. Um, I did get, of course, the Sephora birthday gift for this year. And I chose the... Um, I don't even know how you say this. Why? Oh, why? <laughs> why? Oh... I'm not sure. I've, I've never heard, I've seen this brand, but I've never like heard much about this brand. But um, it came with a detox shampoo, body cleanser, leave-in conditioner, and a little perfume sample. I originally wanted their birthday gift that had the two perfumes in it, but the lady was like, oh, I haven't seen any of those since January. So I don't know what's going on there. So the next best thing was this hair care little kit, especially since I had just cut my hair. So um, this is what the shampoo looks like. And these are pretty big sizes, you know, um, body cleanser and the leave-in conditioner. These smell amazing. But my most favorite item included in this gift was the little Melrose Place perfume. This is actually in one of my purses. But this smells amazing. I really want a full size of this. It smelled really good. I even had my husband take a sniff. I sprayed some and he was just like, oh my gosh, that smells so good. And I was like, yeah, it's the perfume sample that they gave, um, that they included in here. So um, maybe for my next Sephora haul, you will see a full size of this little perfume. But anyways, that was the free gift. Um, I don't know why this is in here. I've been looking for this. This is my <laughs> native deodorant. In case you're wondering, it's in lavender and rose, and it smells amazing. I didn't get it from Sephora. I think I got it from Target. I don't know what it's doing in there. So, I have been seeing this lip... I don't even know what you call it. It's like a lipstick, but also like a lip gloss. It is the Tarte Maracuja Juicy Lip Plump, and I got it in the shade Peachy Beige. And the packaging is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. And you actually click the bottom up for the product to uh, come up in there and i'll put this on for you real quick and you just need just the littlest bit and it just gives like the most beautiful like natural dewy glowy juicy well juicy lip look and I, I absolutely love it. I saw several YouTubers with this and I was like, oh, oh my gosh. I, and I haven't bought a lip product. I haven't bought any makeup actually in a long, long time. So this is my first makeup product in like two years that I actually bought, I think. So 
really, really love this. And um, it does give like kind of like a minty sensation on your lips. But uh, if you're not sensitive to that, then it should be fine. Uh, I didn't really notice a huge change in the shape of my lips. It's supposed to like plump your lips, but I never noticed anything. But maybe you'll see it throughout the video. We'll see. The last item that I got was a perfume and it is Gucci Bloom. I love this perfume. We are actually planning on going to Europe sometime this year. So I wanted a travel perfume for that occasion. And I thought my birthday would be the best time to get a perfume for myself. And this perfume, this smells so good. If you love the scent of a jasmine, this is, this is it please please just go test this out but like always um i always suggest that you try a travel size or a sample size first of a perfume because you just don't know how it reacts to your skin and all of that um and your your body chemistry and um like a scent can change according to who wears it so i would suggest you do that first before you blow all your money on a perfume but this smells so good now let's move on to lululemon so i did make two separate trips to lululemon so the first couple of items are actually the same thing but in two different colors it is this super soft i think it's called the soft stream uh, let me see what it says this was actually in their clearance section and anything soft stream i just i want it if you have to feel the material it is the best material in the entire world um let's see this is called the soft stream turtleneck pullover it was originally 128 dollars um i got it for 89 dollars which is still very expensive but you know but this is what it looks like it's kind of hard to tell it's very very boxy looking and it has this turtleneck but it's all about the fabric if you have ever felt this fabric then you know what i'm talking about it's almost like cool to the touch but it's unlike anything that i've ever felt before and it's just as i'm getting older i feel that i'm getting more and more sensitive to um, clothing materials um i can't do anything itchy or uncomfortable <laughs> anymore so this is perfect so i got the first one in this charcoal color it's called black but it is not black as you can see um, it is very much like a charcoal gray and the other color I got is this very light baby blue which looks so pretty this is such like a springtime or even like a winter color I really really like this color I wasn't sure that it would suit me but my husband was like are you kidding me this feels so good and it looks really good you should get both so I was like sure all right if you insist so I got both this again is the same exact item it's very very oversized which i didn't know but this uh since it was on clearance i mean i had no choice as far as um, size these were literally the only two left and um this is the neck which you fold over like so and it has this ribbed material which is also found on the cuff of the sleeve and also the edge of the actual sweatshirt is this a sweatshirt jumper a pullover yeah um so again i got this on sale as well and then on our next visit to lululemon um i got another one of these t-shirts that i'm actually wearing but in another really pretty color again it's all about the material these are crazy overpriced um this was 48 dollars, but it is called the love crew and if you ever just want a simple t-shirt just to wear like over with some jeans or some tights or something this is my go-to shirt it just perfectly glides over any little lumps or bumps that you may have and it's just very flattering and um i wasn't going to get this but my husband was like what are you doing get that color because he's never seen me in a color like this and again i wasn't sure I I'm, i've never been like a pastel person um ex except for like pink but like yeah, I've never done pastels, but I thought it was so pretty for um, spring and even for summer. I really like this color. They also have like that blue color of the sweatshirt that I showed you. Um, they also have that color as well, but I went with the green, the minty green. These next two items are actually the same thing, but uh, just different sizes and um, prints. This first one was also on the clearance rack, and it is 
very oversized. Um, but I actually liked it that way. So it has this Lululemon print all over it. Let me see if I can find the tag somewhere. I think the tag, I've already removed it from here, but let's see. This is called the Mist Over Windbreaker. And it was originally $128. And I can't remember how much I got it for. I think I got it for $60 or $78. But still. Um... Every time I look at this jacket, I find something new. Like, I don't even know what this is on the back of the neck. Um, but it's like right below the hoodie. I guess it's to hang your coat, you know? And it has two zipper pockets right in the front here. And then there is a zipper pocket on the back, which is quite interesting. So, I don't know. But again, this is like quite literally double my size. <laughs> But I loved how oversized it was. It also has the thumb holes, which we love. And it has Lululemon written in this like glowy material right here. And like I mentioned, this is literally double my size. But sometimes all I want is oversized, oversized everything, especially during that time of the month. And you just don't feel like wearing clothes. You just don't want anything touching you. <sighs> This is, this is what I would opt for. Something very, very comfy. So this is the first one. The second one is the same exact jacket, just in black. And I actually don't have a workout jacket that is plain black, which is so unlike me because I always go for black. That is my first choice for everything. Um, but yeah, it's, uh, it's the exact same thing, except that it's plain black. And this one was not on sale. This was $128. And this one is actually my size, so it's very fitted. And since it is my size, it creates like such a nice hourglass effect, which I do not have. So um, I really, really like this jacket. I almost didn't get it because of the price, but my husband was like, you need to get that. That looks so good. And um, so I did. And I'm glad I did because I know that I will get a lot of use for this. Because I can't tell you how many times I have gone to the gym and I was like, oh, I wish I just had a plain black jacket. Just just a plain black jacket and a light one. This is a very light material. Um, again, this is a windbreaker, so it's not anything that would give you like a lot of warmth or anything. But I love this material. It's very, very stretchy and... Oh, I would definitely check this out. Moving on, I did get some stuff from Victoria's Secrets. All of that is downstairs, but it was the, um, well, I actually got three things. They were all strapless bras. Strapless bras are so hard to shop for. Um, I definitely suggest you go in there and get measured, which is what I did. And I got three of their like latest strapless bras and they are amazing. I will put up pictures for you guys and links as well to let you know which ones exactly I got because I just got one of each. They had like four total, um, but I got three out of the four because it was buy two, get one free. And so um, I got some strapless bras finally. And the strapless bras actually also come with straps. So you can also wear them with straps. You just have to hook these on. So um, yeah. You can wear them strapless or not. But I also did get some sports bras from Amazon. These did come in a pack of two. And this is what it looks like. The front and the back both have straps. But the front is the main reason why I got this. Because it looks like this in the front. It's a little decorative. And I got this mainly because my Lululemon tops that I normally wear to work out. They're very low cut. And so I wanted something here to kind of cover up but also be a little decorative you know add to the look a little bit and these were perfect um i haven't worked out in these yet they still have their um tag on them but they look and feel very soft so um hopefully hopefully these work out but either way i just love the look of them so i got a black and a white pair like so and then i got another one because i Again, I'm running low on sports bras. This also came in a pack of two, but they look a little bit different. The strappiness is a little a, a little different, especially in the back. Um, the design is a little bit more complicated with this one. But again, I got white and black because 
you just can't go wrong with the most basic of colors they just uh go with everything and i do have some random items <laughs> to share with you guys from amazon um foot care foot care has been very important i've been wearing more and more heels lately and um i find that these are very helpful this is called mole skin and it's basically like a band-aid but you just put it on the parts where your shoe is rubbing your foot or your skin wrong and it kind of acts as a barrier so there's that it comes with 10 sheets pre-cut so I really like that. And then, I haven't used this yet, but I heard that girls, uh, when they wear high heels, they use um, like a numbing spray. So I've yet to try this, but hopefully this works. It's just the maximum strength lidocaine, and it's like 4% lidocaine. So we'll see. I'll try to update you guys on Instagram or something. Because of my new haircut, um, I wanted something to protect my hair when I sleep. And so I got this um pillowcase this is what it came in um the pillowcase i will show you somewhere up here um, but they are silk and um it feels so lovely when you sleep on these beautiful silk pillowcases and so far i haven't noticed any like extra frizzing with my hair which i mean it's, my hair is naturally already frizzy so the silk pillowcases have helped immensely and they feel so nice they're so like cooling to the head i don't know how to explain it silk pillowcases have a lot of benefits um not just for your hair but also for your skin uh, and it is antibacterial i believe so i thought why not let's give it a shot and me and my husband both love our silk pillowcases and it came in a lot of colors we went with the gray but um yeah there are a lot of colors and sizes that you can get and last but not least i got a book i was actually telling my husband about this book and how much i loved reading little women um when i was younger and this one is just so special because i mean obviously it looks so beautiful but also it has um, the letters and manuscripts from the characters like in here. Isn't that so cool? Like you can actually pull it out. Let me see if I can. That is so cool. It kind of takes you a little bit more into that world and I love things like that. So um, I can't wait to read this again. It's been so many years since I've read Little Women, but I remember it being my absolute favorite book. So. I can't wait and it's so beautiful this is gonna look so pretty on my bookshelf i absolutely love it all right you guys so that was it for my birthday series part one i hope you guys enjoyed make sure to stay tuned for the next several parts that i will be uploading please subscribe if you haven't already give this video a big thumbs up and i will see you guys in my next video bye